Hi YouTube. That's gross. I'm not. Okay. Hi. I'm going to be moving out of the dorms at UT Austin. I lived in the dorms for the first semester, but I decided to stay home for the second semester. And when I was about to move in last year, I couldn't really find that many videos on the dorm. So today I decided to film the dorm. I wanted to show you what it looked like without anything in there because I was obsessed with watching videos of the dorm. I watched so many of them. I also decided to link the videos that I found super helpful in the description box below. The two videos that I thought were really good were the ones by this girl from the Woman in Engineering LLC. Those are really recent. It gives like a pretty good picture of what the dorms look like present day. And there's a super old UT video that gives a good picture of like what the dorm looks overall. Like Kins Market, the dining hall. Coming back home, I'm not gonna be in downtown Austin as much. So I'm further away from another one of my favorite breakfast places, Snooze. So we stopped there before we went to get my stuff back. We also stopped at Haley Cake, which is a super good cookie place that has the cutest cookies. So I'm gonna show y'all a little montage of the food. afraid to film in public but here's what the outside of the building looks like and if you look across the street we have Durin which is another dorm in Guad cleaning up a bit I had some trash to take out so I ended up in the washer and dryer room. Here's where we have trash cans and a washer and dryer which are completely free to use. Then I went to the 2.5 floor because I wanted to see it one last time. On the 2.5 floor you'll find study rooms, lounge area, this TV that I don't think I ever saw on and I'm heading towards the gym that I never got to use. And over here is the kitchen that was also closed all semester. Here is one of my favorite parts about living in Consolving was the sun deck. Sometimes I would wake up super early and do yoga here. It was also really nice to just get outside without actually having to leave the dorm. Now I'm gonna be showing you my empty room, both sides of it, because my roommate is also not returning for the spring semester. So right here is the sink that she will share with your roommate. Down here, we have some storage space. This is where I kept my cleaning supplies. And the room is the same on both sides. We have a vanity thing with a light up mirror that I never used. I don't think I ever turned this on. And we have a lot of storage space right here. I don't have the exact measurements, maybe they're online, but we have three of these little thingies. Just lots of little storage. This room actually has quite a bit of storage. So as it goes down, it increases in depth. This is the big one. 
Sometimes the store would fall out, but it's fine. And then we have our beds and a board that you can pin stuff to cover it up. We also have another board that you can also decorate. And here's the bed. And underneath the bed, we have more storage space. We have three pull out drawers. When me and my roommate first moved in, they did not pull out. So we had to call the housing people and they came in and fixed that for us. Here we have the desk area, which also has a good amount of storage. Definitely utilized to that. We have plugs and a pull-out desk. Some recycling bins and each room comes with a microwave and a fridge. My fridge was definitely stuffed to the max all semester. And on the other side, it will be exactly the same setup. Here's the view from this side of the room. Up here, we have even more storage space. I'm kind of too short to realistically use it. So I have to jump up every time I wanted anything. Also, you could catch me and my roommate standing on our desks to reach things at the top. Here we have a cute little full body mirror. It's pretty convenient. And on both sides, we have a decent sized closet. Here's the top drawer, a rack, and some floor space. So overall, I had a pretty good dorm experience, but I decided to stay home spring semester because I got a weekend job. And having my parents pick me up every single Friday night would not be realistic. And additionally, I'm getting my permit in February, so I really wanna work on driving. There's definitely a lot of things I'm gonna miss about this place, but I had a great first semester and I'm fine with those memories. I have three more years to look forward to. And I'm not that far away from Austin, so I don't mind going home. I hope you found this video helpful. Let me know if you would like any more information on consolving because like I said, whenever I was going through this process of looking for dorms at UT, I binge watch videos. I don't care if they were like 10 years old, five years old, I watched them, I took notes. I was mentally planning my room, Pinterest boards. I hope you have a great rest of your day. So I'm gonna go home now and unpack everything and clean my room. Bye.